This video shows how to use Los Rios Google Apps to stream a video file and to embed the video inside Desire to Learn. The first step is to upload the video to Google Drive. For this example, a folder already exists for videos. Click the Upload button, select Files, and choose a video file. Just about any video file type can be converted. Select a video and click Open. In the Upload Settings dialog, the Convert button must be checked. Click, then click Start Upload. After Upload, click the Share link to prepare the video for sharing this while waiting for Google to finish processing. Click the Change link to make it a video that is visible to anyone with the link. Though the Los Rios options may look more appropriate, they will add unnecessary hassle for students without adding to the educational value of the video. Click Save, and then Done. Click on the name of the video file within the Upload dialog to open it in a new browser tab or window. There are three steps to take care before sharing this inside desire to learn First, click on the name of the video to change it if necessary. This is not a name that students will see, but may make the list of files inside Google Drive easier to manage. Then click the File menu on the web page and click on the option to prevent viewers from downloading. Finally, click on the File menu on the web page and click on Embed this video. Copy the code in the dialog and click OK. The video is now ready to be embedded inside a Desire to Learn course offering. Inside Desire to Learn, navigate to a module in the content area, click the new document and select Create a File. The title for this document is what students will click on to open the page. Type any instructional context for the video. And then click the button to insert stuff. In the insert stuff dialog, click on the option to enter embed code and then paste the code that was copied from Google Drive. Click Next, and then click Insert. Once the video finishes processing on Google's ends, a thumbnail for the video will appear. Click Publish, and the video is ready for viewing by students.